Hi guys, just a quick check in. Uh, I was going to talk about the rhododendron cuttings. Um, I'm kind of learning as I go and a bit of an amateur, but uh, just about how long some of these things take to root and basically not to give up on them. And you've got to have extreme patience with some of them. These ones I've got in this plastic box, see the lid there, so I've had them sealed the whole time. I took these in midsummer, which is January for us. Uh, 2023 so start of January 2023 and it's now March 2024 so these are over 14 months old since I took them and uh, I've had the odd one root and I've removed them you can see where the gaps are but the vast oh and the odd ones died and gone rotten so if anything rots I pull it out straight away so it's the odd one I've removed but the majority of them have just sat there and done nothing um, and I did mention in an earlier video I did wonder about the rooting gel I'd used and whether it had got a bit past it because I've had much faster success in the past but um, these ones, the majority of them just sat there and did nothing so for over a year and uh, even at the one year mark most of them were doing nothing but they're still green and still look fine no growth of course um, but I've just opened them up so now being March, sort of towards the end of our summer, and obviously just that bit of prolonged warmth, and now you can see a lot of these, if I give them a tap, usually you can just touch them, you can feel straight away. That one hasn't, because it's wobbly. But the vast majority of these, now, in fact I'd say virtually all of them, except that one there, have now rooted so um, I'll pop these on oh maybe I'll pull one out for a look-see see what the roots look like oh that one's well stuck in he's got obviously tons of roots what about this guy oh yeah heaps of roots there what is that Virginia Richards so there you go that's um finally rooting after 14 months and once they start rooting they seem to develop a root ball extremely rapidly once they get underway um, so yeah I guess the point of this video was just to say be patient with your rhododendrons and as long as they're still green just give them a chance and like I say I've kept these in the shade in the uh, in the plastic box so the little mini greenhouse and just keep an eye on them every few months and it's, it's a long game but um, it just goes to show you the majority of them can be rooted with a bit of patience.